get outside and have a good time. Uh, it's a fantastic place. So much fun. Let's bring in Daniel Strobel from Nashville Shores. Daniel, how are you, pal? I'm doing great. How are you doing, Big Joe? Good. Thanks for doing this. All right, you guys opened last week. Summer's here, man. It's like yesterday was January. Now we're here. A lot of fun. What a great time now. Weather's going to be nice to head out and see you guys at Nashville Shores. Yeah, definitely. I'm so excited, first of all, to see that great weather report. Uh, we opened this past weekend. We are now open weekends only uh, through uh, Thursday, May 26th. Before going into Memorial Day weekend will be when we, we're open daily. But right now we're open weekends. Look, the weather looks great for this weekend. Uh, we're also doing a, a special uh, $20 off adult admission for this weekend only. Uh, so you can get into the park for just $29.99. Come out and enjoy some of the, the slides, the wave pool, Lazy River, all that good stuff we got going out there. I love it, man. I love it. I think, uh, you know, a water park is essential to a community, to a city. And you guys have that out there. Uh, did you guys add anything new this year? Because you're always adding stuff. If you never add anything else again, it'd be fantastic. But some of the rides you got out there now that you've added the last couple of years, man, so much fun. Yeah, we actually are. We added a awesome ride, a Mega Mayhem uh, during the COVID year. So a lot of people haven't had a chance to come out and, and enjoy it and uh, ride it. But it's a fantastic ride. Uh, this year, we're actually have added a um, huge LED screen on our wave pool wall. Uh, so we'll be able to show videos throughout the day, sporting events, uh, and what, most importantly, uh, we'll be able to show our dive-in movies earlier in the day. In the past, we had a, uh, a blow-up screen that we'd show by the, that we had by the wave pool, and we'd had to wait till it got dark to, to show it. So this year, we're going to be able to show it a little bit earlier, which will be fantastic. Um, it's got uh, over 308,000 pixels, almost weighs about two tons, uh, 25,000 watts. It's uh, it's pretty impressive. So we're excited about that. And then we just uh, upgraded some of the concessions areas, restrooms, those kind of things, just to make the guest experience a little better. I love Mega Mayhem. We did that live on TV last year, uh, and that was a lot of fun, too, So doing all that over there. And, I, you know, what's underrated about your place, Daniel, is the, the kids' water park, which – I, you know, as a 53-year-old man, I like the kids' water park. It's simple and it's fun, and there's something for everybody there. Yeah, you're exactly right. We have, um, I mean, you got the big slides for uh, the bigger people, the older older people that they love that, all the thrilling slides. But we have two water tree houses and playgrounds, spray grounds uh, for the younger kids as well. Um, there's a picture right there, the Barefoot and Bay. Uh, that's more for the toddlers, you know, five and under. And then we have another one called Cowabunga Beach which is about 12 and under, but we definitely have uh, something for everyone out at Nashville Shores. Our kids can enjoy, they can ride around the lazy river or the wave pool. We got the beach area as well. So just got a little bit of something for everyone. All right. So let's go back again. You guys open on the 26th, you said for the, for the every day for the summer. Yeah. Every day for the summer, starting the 26th until then we'll be open every Saturday and Sunday. Something else too, that's, near the park is your treetop adventure park that goes on with zip lining. I think this is Daniel vastly underrated a part of the adventure to come see you guys. It's I've done it. You know, it was, uh, it's fun. It challenges you, which I think a good uh, treetop adventure park should do that. But man, this is really cool too. Yeah, we, it was a, I think we added about 10 years ago and it's just been a great addition to our property. And a lot of people don't know that we have, about 385 acres out here at Nashville Shores, and the water park's just a small part of it. We got the Treetop Adventure Park out here, and it's it's um, it's not a traditional zip line park uh, because there's a lot of challenges. The zip lines are interspersed within uh, the challenges, so there's bridges and and uh, swinging like Tarzan swings, all kinds of great stuff. It's a good little workout, about two to three hours to do it. Um, yeah. It's fantastic. But other than that, other than that, we also got lodging out here, cabins. RV sites, a marina, boat rentals. We just kind of uh, have transformed, you know, in the past 10, 12 years, uh, just growing every year and kind of become more of a regional destination, not just our local water park. Yeah, and I see, you know, we've I've talked to you. I've known you for years with everything that goes on there. It's just a great escape from – life to spend a day at Nashville Shores because there's so much to do. And if you got kids, it's perfect. If you're an adult and have no kids, go sit up by the pool. I mean, there's just something for everything, everyone there at Nashville Shores. You're exactly right. And one of the best things or ways to take advantage of Nashville Shores is our season pass. So for $69.99, uh, we're open 95 days. I mean, you can 
visit every day if you want for just a little under seventy dollars. So I mean, so if you want to come in after work and you know cool off or before and all that kind of stuff, that's that's probably the best value I would say. And also you get free tickets for friends and discounts and all that kind of stuff. But um, I mean, it's unlimited visits all summer. It's 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 probably the best deal in town. You know what it reminds me of, Daniel, is when we all grew up going to Opryland. Opryland, you buy the season pass, perfect for the entire summer. Parents just drop you off yeah. and see ya. Yeah, you're exactly right. That's I'm sure I bumped into you sometimes at Opryland back in the day. But uh, no, it's it's um, great for parents, great for kids. Um, there's not much in town. Uh, I mean, for young, for you know, 12 and under, 15 and under, uh, good, safe quality fun and we hope to bring that and i think we do i love uh i like the map here daniel this shows where every and this is you know it looks it's cute and everything but there is so much involved in what you guys have there then with the map to show with the wave pool with the big pool with the bucket splash with the slides with mega mayhem i mean it's an all-day affair when you go to national shores it is and uh one of the things i haven't mentioned yet is on the top of that map is our aqua park And one of the things that makes us really unique, I don't know if we're the only, you know, water park in the country or one of very few that are on a lake. So you can get go out there. Our aqua park has, um, you know, seesaws, big bridges and those kind of things. It's basically an inflatable obstacle course on the lake. And that's another a lot of people don't have the opportunity to visit a lake or have never been in the lake. And that's one of the things that we also give them the ability to do as well. How have I missed the aqua park? I don't know. I have no idea. But next time you come out here, uh, you need to run around on that. It's um, it, you people go out for 15 minutes at a time and someone like you and myself, that's all we need. Right. <laughs> that is all we need. You're exactly right with that. All right. That's cool. I'm so glad you guys are back open this weekend. And of course, hopping on the uh on the 26th full time and get things going. I, you know, I love National Shores. I love what you guys do out there. I love how you took the whole Hermitage Landing and you mm-hmm. made this really unique for us in our area. So great job by you guys, man. And I hope it's sunny and 80 the rest of the summer, Daniel. We do too. I, I would love to have that weather and I appreciate you, uh, your support throughout the years. I appreciate you letting me on this morning and um, we'll see you out there. All right, Daniel. Thank you, brother. Hey, by the way, uh, you guys are hiring, right? Oh, yes, yes. We're hiring all positions, NashvilleShores.com forward slash jobs. Uh, it's a great first job for a lot of people, even uh, for older individuals as well, teachers or, you know, people that have free time in the summer. Or your six year old, 16-year-old son who got to get out of the house. That's true, too. <laughs> That's true, too. They might as well get paid for it if you're kicking them out. That's right. <laughs> yeah. All right, Daniel Strobel, National Shores. Thanks, man. We'll talk to you soon. All right. We'll see you. All Thank right. you. Well done. There you go. National Shores back up and running. They open this weekend and open full time come the 26th. So plenty of time to get ready and go out there and have fun. I mean, every time we go, I mean, it is a lot of fun. There's so much to see and do out there at Nashville Shores. (music) 